Hi, it's Doc and Skip with our daily video, powered by AmericanPrideRoasters.com. A woman in Texas named Charnisa Corley was pulled over for a traffic stop. The cop said he smelled pot. They ordered a female officer in who forcibly gave her a body cavity search Ooh. in the parking lot of a gas station. Yeah. You sure this wasn't Deming, New Mexico? When she refused to comply with the body cavity search, they forcibly held her down, spread her legs, and proceeded with the body cavity search in the gas station parking lot. That seems excessive. You know why that is? What's that? Because it's excessive. Mm. As horrible as this is, and I cannot condone the police behavior whatsoever, she would have more ground to stand on if they hadn't found pot on her. It's my understanding they also found crack. Perhaps we just move on. The latest person to have one of their concert writers released is Pharrell, and we found out it takes a lot to keep him happy. I see what you did there, because he has a song called Happy. Yeah, exactly. So what keeps him happy? I get it pretty early in the morning. Pun there, something yeah. like that. If you ask me, Pharrell is just Bobby McFerrin 2.0. Some of the things on Pharrell's writer include a bottle of Patron tequila, a bottle of Kettle One vodka, a jar of grape jelly, a loaf of gluten-free bread, and a framed photo of Carl Sagan. Wait, what? Uh, yeah, framed photo of Carl Sagan. Nothing says classy like getting liquored up on Patron, eating a gluten-free jelly sandwich, and staring at that picture of Carl Sagan. Also, all the advertising in the venue has to be darkened because he says, we're not hawking pizzas or the local ambulance chaser. Ukrainian armed forces are recruiting and training a new kind of soldier. Raccoons. We got people bitching about the gays in the military here. They got raccoons? The raccoons are going to be used for combat engineering purposes. Translation, they're going to look for bombs. That and frog baseball. Does it seem to you like they care much about the raccoons being blown up? No, do you care about the raccoons being blown up? No, no, not at all. There it is. For the safety of Ukraine, I do have one suggestion on how they can really ramp up that program though. That's sad. Uh, they should start using Canada geese. Just, uh, I think they could be really effective tools in keeping Ukraine safe. That's smart. Our daily video is powered by the best coffee at AmericanPrideRoasters.com. Please check out our daily radio show on demand anytime at TheBlaze.com slash Doc and Skip.